This video is a sample from the Secret Guitar Teacher Interactive course, The Five Main Elements of Music. The five main elements of music. Element number two, scales. Section 2.8, minor scales. Part one, relative and parallel scales. There are quite a few ways of looking at minor scales. But let's start with one that we have already introduced earlier on the course. Here's a reminder of what we call relativeness in music theory. For every major key, there is a relative minor key. Relative keys share the same key signature. The relative minor scale starts on the sixth degree of its relative major scale. So here we see how the minor scale can be directly derived from the relative major simply by starting a couple of notes further down the scale. 8, 7, 6. And this works for any key. Here's an example in the keys of B major and its relative G sharp minor. Whereas there is really only one type of major scale, minor scales come in several types. The type of minor scale that is directly derived from the relative major scale, as we have just described, is called the natural minor scale. But, as well as understanding how it is derived from the relative major scale, it's also useful to understand how to form the natural minor scale directly from the major scale of the same name. We already took a brief look at this back in lesson 2.6.9, how to use the major scale as a yardstick. The way we derive formulas in music is to compare the element of music in question with the major scale of the same note name. Major and minor keys that share the same note name are referred to as parallel keys. So, to derive the natural minor scale formula from the scale of A minor, we need to compare to the scale of A major. And when we do this, we can see that to change the major scale to the minor, the third, sixth and seventh notes are all lowered by a semitone. As mentioned earlier on the course, scale formulas are generally described in terms of how the scale in question is different from the yardstick major scale. So the formula for the natural minor scale is flat 3, flat 6, flat 7. This tells us that we can take any major scale and lower the 3rd, 6th and 7th notes by a semitone and we'll, we will have changed it to the natural minor scale in the parallel key. And that is exactly what we shall be doing in the next lesson. So, just to recap, we've looked at two useful ways to arrive at a natural minor scale. 
by using the notes of any major scale, starting from step six of that scale, the relative method, or by applying the formula flat three, flat six, flat seven to any major scale, the parallel method. Both have their practical uses for guitar players. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you'd really like to maximise your potential as a guitar player, click on the link in the description below to the Secret Guitar Teacher site. Here you can sign up for a 30-day trial free of charge and without obligation. We won't even ask you for your credit card number. <laughs>